Hello, and you are watching The Great TV. I am your host, J.P. Forte. Today I'm giving the title of the world's most horrible people title to Nestle CEO Peter Brabeck. The reason why is because Peter Brabeck recently made a statement saying that he supports water being privatized by the corporations, and he also said that people do not have any right to water. Can you believe that? Water. One of the substances on this planet that gives and sustains life and that no living organism can survive without and this asshole is saying that people do not have a right to water. Although in a way it is kind of uh, funny and twisted if you think about it because Peter Brabeck himself is a human being and he said that human beings do not have a right to water. So that also means that Peter Brabeck does not have any right to water either. You know, I got a good idea. There is one way I think that Peter Brabeck could change his little tune. Although, unfortunately, if it were done, people would get into some serious trouble. But it would be funny if a group of people got a hold of Peter Brabeck, took him out to Death Valley, stuck him in a pen with four walls all around so he can't get out and he can't escape, and let him sit there in the sweltering dry heat for a while and deny him any water. And in the meantime, while he's getting real thirsty, everybody just sit on top of those walls in front of him, drinking water in front of him, taunting him, and then act like they're going to give him some water. And then, just as he's about to get the water, pull it away and say, oh, that's right, you said human beings don't have a right to water. And then, just when he's about to collapse from thirst, and just before he gets stroke, then we finally give him some water. And then we ask him, well, do you still think that human beings don't have a right to water? And if he still has not changed his tune on that, then we start the process all over again. I know that to do it that way is pretty much impossible unless people want to get some serious prison time. So there is another way to get Peter Brabeck to change his little tune. Because if you think about it, Peter Brabeck is one sick individual to make a statement like he did. So another way to get him to change his tune is to stop buying Nestle bottled water. As a matter of fact, being since all of these assholes seem to think that it's all about them, then maybe we all should stop buying bottled water, period. And for everybody that's afraid of the chemicals and the tap water, such as fluoride, which really has no business in water anyway, then get yourself some of those water filters that can filter out all those chemicals in the fluoride, and get yourself some reusable water bottles, and get your water source that way. I guarantee after that, the CEOs to these corporations will be changing their tunes real quick. Because it's obvious that they've forgotten that it's not about the corporate CEO or the corporation. It's about the consumers buying the products. And if they want to abuse the very people that are buying their products, then maybe the people should not buy any of their products. I guarantee if that happened, these corporations would be changing their ways real soon.